Good morning, it's Dr. James. I'm so happy to have a few moments with you today. Thank you for your time, thank you for your energy, and most importantly, thank you for your courageous conviction for showing up each and every day to create a life that you love. Oh my gosh, look at those clouds. They're absolutely beautiful this morning. I hope you're ready to have something phenomenal happen in you and through you. And today, I set a prayer, I set an intention, I said, I wanna dedicate myself to giving you two minutes of something that can literally change every area of your life in the most profound and wonderful way. In fact, clinical studies, the science tells us that this one practice can help you have a longer and stronger relationship with a loved one. It can actually help you to have a greater success in every of your life in terms of relationships, your work, your monetary success, and every area there as well. Help your immune system, increase your happiness, generally help you to get your life rocking in every area. What is this one quality? It's humility. In fact, studies show that the practice of humility will help you to create more positivity and more abundance in every area of your life. And here's the cool thing. When you think about the word humility, let me just ask you, what do you think of? What's that quality? Do you feel like it's actually someone who's quiet and possibly playing down? Well, you know what? That's classically how people think about the word humility and its definition. But I did a little bit of research. In fact, I went into the Bible, and the Bible actually tells us, it's really interesting. The Bible said it simply means practicing kindness, being courteous, and being generous and respectful. Kind, generous, respectful, and courteous. That's humility. What wonderful qualities are that? So here, getting back to the research, and you're gonna love this. So what can you do today to help you become more humble, help you to get your humility on, which can lead to so much success in every area of your life that you value and you'll hold near and dear? Well, there's a few things that you can do according to the research. Number one, you wanna practice being a great listener. I know, it sounds like, oh my gosh, well that's an obvious one, but studies show that the people who are actually beginning conversations by asking a question of the person they're conversing with first before they go into their whatever their agenda is ask a question first number two this is really really awesome practice awe practice awe simply get outdoors simply get in a place where you are literally how should we say put in perspective I think weather is great in this relationship of getting you and getting your awe on I think being in the natural world is helpful in getting your awe on. And here's another beautiful thing you can do. This is the practice that I think really brings this full circle. Accepting the challenges and failures. Accepting them as lessons in your life. People who actually are really good with humility are the ones who go into life as a student, as a disciple. They go in looking for the opportunity to go for their life's greatest expression. And when they fail, because they will when you're going for it in life, it just is part of the journey, you also have to be a student and say to yourself, okay, what's the lesson? What's the opportunity? How can I take this and really run with it as I move forward in my life? That's a practice of humility. So you get it really beautiful. Ask a question first. Number two, practice awe. And number three, practice humility being by being a student of your failures. And you will help yourself to have greater life purpose. You will help yourself to have greater workplace success. If you're married or in a relationship, you'll help that to be longer and stronger. And yes, your immune system and your overall happiness will be improved by being in a humble state throughout the day as you journey through your life. So with that, I humbly say how much I love and appreciate you. Thank you for showing up and being who you are. And I wish you much love and many blessings on your journey each and every day. All the very best. Bye-bye.